Okay, now, hold on there. What we're gonna do is, now what I did is, since I'm getting down so close, I went and got me a thumb guard, okay? And uh, I nicked myself just a little bit, I really did, trying to, so I went and got me a thumb guard, which is, uh, whenever I get this close, I usually go get me, not a thumb guard, but some, and I use Band-Aids, and I just barely nicked myself, I got just a little bit of blood. I mean, it didn't even go enough, but it teaches me sometimes when you get that close in, you want to go ahead and go get you something to protect your thumb. <laughs> because it, you don't care how long you've been carving, you can nick yourself. And actually, I nicked myself not through the carving process, but with a knife. Uh, not to say that I don't. I, I'm, I've nicked myself many, many times. But it's good to go ahead when you get down this close to your th fingers and stuff to go ahead and get you a, and I make them out of band-aids, just like this. See how I get the band-aids and make them? Where it, you know, if it slips, it's... Okay, now, what we have here is we just keep bringing that hand down, okay? And then we come in here, and actually you're gonna use a push cut, but you kind of bring that up on both sides. We're gonna finish this up real quick here. But I thought, you know what, I nicked myself a little bit. Let me go and get a, get a little thumb guard, make me a little thumb guard, so that I don't go any further than that, in other words. Okay, now, we're gonna do this. And this is the back of the hand here. So we wanna bring that down. Okay, you see that, how that's, that's going? How it fits, let me bring this kind of. But we need to bring this, this gun down even some more. This area in here, it's a little bit raised, but we still wanna bring it down a little bit more because the barrel is still just a little bit uh, a little bit too thick. Okay, now that looks better. That looks a whole lot better. And we wanna bring that down just a little bit more, but not much, just a little bit. And let's bring this a little bit more down here. Yeah, you can always tell when they hear that. When the kids get off of school, it's just, it's like a, a madhouse around here. The racing and the music and the stuff like that, in other words. It's, everybody wants to try out their car, you know. Like I said, we used to do the same thing. We used to race. Of course, back when I was going to high school, I didn't have money to have a car, so. I didn't race. <laughs> I never had the money. Didn't even have enough money to go to the prom, so. Okay. Now look, now it's starting to look. Let me get the arm here. Now it's really starting to look the way we want it, just like this, in other words. Just like that. Okay. Alright. Now what we're gonna do, we're gonna remove all of this in here and make it a little bit that see where it's going to be like that and now we want to just continue to bring the hand down I'm sorry I'll come down here and just sort of 
Now, like I said, this is the this is the top. Okay. And here is the hand up here. And we're going to separate that just a little bit. Okay, looking good, looking good. And up here we have a little bit of a... So we don't have to really put a trigger on it. I mean, a, 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 yeah, a trigger. So, um, because the hand is over the trigger. That's three blocks away. Wow. That's amazing. Can you imagine what it's doing to the ears of those people that are next to it? I know I worked in a refinery for 40 years. I don't, I don't hear too good at all. These people today, they're going to be deaf by the time they're 40. Okay. All right. I'll cut just a little bit up there and get that... Okay, I'm just cleaning up a little bit in here, making it just a little bit thinner. All right, you got the gest general gist of the idea here. This is the, um, kind of bring that down, sort of thin that up just in there. Now I'm just going to make a little cut right in here, kind of come down a line like that. And I'm going to separate that barrel just a little bit right in there. I just wanted to make a little so that can kind of come down, okay? In fact, I wanted to make it just a little bit higher, see? Then I bring this down. But that can also be part of the wood. And I'm going to do the same thing over here. I'm just going to bring that up just a little bit. And separate the barrel from it. And just bring this down a little bit, okay? That way I can bring that down. Okay. Okay. All right. Now we're getting it. Now a lot of you you want to get maybe a lot of you want to do better detail and all that stuff I'm not really worried all about that in other words all the detail and you know some of you P guys are you want to have everything just perfect I don't worry about that kind of stuff I just like to and in flat plane carving we're not we're not looking for exact realism we're looking for cuts that we can do okay see that now and then this sort of... Now, what we want to do is to kind of give you an idea of how this looks in such a way. All right. Is we want to take the arm. This is how I end up cutting myself. A lot of times when I set my knife down, I'll nick myself because it's so sharp that it'll... Uh, okay, now see that? In fact, I can come in even further with this part right here. Let me uh, let me come. Let me take some more off this hand. Okay. 
that will make the um, okay now watch now look at that see and the gun goes over his shoulder the gun gun goes over his shoulder like this and it glues into there like that in other words in fact I'm gonna even come in a little bit even a little bit further with this okay notice how this is too high so it's got a curve it's got a curve in so this I need to take a little bit off right here okay there it goes see just take that little bit off in there where it fits even better there you go and see that where it fits on the shoulder just like that Fits, fits just, you know, the gun fits on the shoulder just like that. Okay. I'll just cut a little bit of this up in here. But here you go. It, it's going to fit like this. It's going to fit this way. The gun's going to fit. And I need to bring this down just a little bit more too. This, this here. Cut just a little bit of that. Be careful because that's we don't want to cut too much. We're just making it, we're making the hand flip just a little bit. Okay. Hold it like that, and it comes down like that. There you go. See that? See? And that leaves him walking like that. Now you can even bring uh, you can even bring it down like this even more if you want that. Okay? You can, or you can actually bring it up. Actually, you can bring it up even further. You can actually bring where it just basically sits. Uh, it doesn't matter how you position it, basically. You don't want to come too far down here like this because that doesn't look natural. But usually it's somewhere around in there. Okay? Where you... Uh, Get the, get the hand and the arm fit like that. Okay, you see that? All right. Well, there we are. We've carved now uh, both pieces. Uh, I'll get these two glued together. I'll get this uh, this all glued together here. I'll come in just a little bit like that. here and that up a little bit more with that I'm just gonna let that be the be the um, I won't come in a little bit more whoops I'll take a little bit more off here There we go. Okay, this is looking real good. And this is what we want. And I'll show you once again. It's going to fit like this, the arm. And then the hand's going to come, and it's going to be glued onto here, glued onto there. And then it will uh, fit. The, 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 the barrel will fit uh, up here like that. Okay? All right, and I'll clean this up a little bit, and even more, and and and, and get, uh, and I'll I'll take and put the the, the uh, fingers on the the thing and the hand and all that stuff. But you've got the general idea of what the shape of that's going to be. So anyway, God bless you now, and um, uh, we'll uh, once again let me show you the. This is the this is the other. So what you're going to see. 
Let me get this knife out of my hand before I drop it. You're gonna have this right here, and then you're gonna have this where the, on this side, and when I glue it, I'll show you. When I glue it, it's gonna be on there. Now we gotta bring some of this, on the, on the, on the, on the, we gotta bring this, these socks down a little bit, in other words. They're not really, well, they're thermal socks, as we might say. I apologize for the, the music. I really do. I'm outside. I thought maybe being outside, I wouldn't have to deal with all that. But unfortunately, I did, and I apologize for that. I know it's not, but uh, like I said, I'm three blocks away, and I thought three blocks away, I wouldn't have any problem. But unfortunately, um, that's not the case. So anyway, all right, I'll get these this glued together. I'll get this hand glued also. Oops, just like this, okay. I'll get that glued like that. And uh, then I'll shape it more even after that, okay. All right, well, God bless you now. And uh, be careful. And uh, we're slowly but surely getting our little uh, duck hunter, uh, goose hunter done and uh, uh, ready. So, okay, God bless now.